Okay, so on to the next portion which is going to be installing the LEDs. I'm going to be putting a blue for number one, a white for number two, a blue for number three, and a white for number four. And um, in this case, I'm going to show you, I'm going to try and show you, you can't really see them at all because they're so small. So it's kind of hard for me to actually do a video showing you these LEDs. But what I'm doing right now is I'm positioning the very small LED onto the pads and I'm gonna see if I have it installed there by turning the controller on. There's a battery in it. I'm gonna turn the controller on and push on the LED and that's not the correct way to put it so I have to flip the LED around and put it on that pad again and turn the controller on and push down on the pad. Now see that the light came on, it's blinking. So while it's while it's on that pad, I'm gonna slowly pop the battery out to shut the controller off. And put the battery back in. Take my soldering iron and with one finger I'm gonna hold down that LED and tack on the one side of the of the solder just to hold that LED in place okay now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the other side and tap the other side keeping that LED right there and now that LED should be installed so when I go and turn the controller on again that LED comes on so we know that that one's working while the controller is on, I'm going to take my white one and put it up here and slide it into place and I'm going to see if I get a good connection from it. This is number two. Okay, I, j I just saw the white come on so I'm pretty sure I got that right. Yep, see it? That white one came on. So I'm going to slowly take off the battery until the first light goes off. Now I know that the power is, is off to the, the controller and the controller shut off. I'm going to take my soldering iron and tap it again. And now tap the other side. And I'm going to turn on the controller. And I've got two LEDs. Okay, now I'm going to do the third one while the controller's on. Right now it's just syncing. You're just seeing the, uh, the sync process. Let's take the, the light, put it down to number three. Number three is going to be, uh, let me see, what do I want number three to be? I want number three to be white, so I'm going to do number four is blue. These little, these little SMDs are so small, they're really hard to maneuver. You just have to be really careful with them. Okay, so I got it on four, and it's not turning on, so I'm just going to flip it around. I know I'm going to get comments, oh well there's a positive and a negative and blah blah blah. Well the LEDs that I got are so cheap and <laughs> it doesn't show me which side is which and I don't remember. So. Jeez. That LED didn't like me. Okay, let's try this again. Oh. See, even I have a problem with it.
There you go. Got number three going. Okay, so number three is going. You could really do this with the with the power on. I'm gonna show it to you. You don't you don't really want to, but you can. It's not gonna blow the controller out or anything. You just really gotta be quick with it. Otherwise you could burn out the LED. And we'll do the last one, the white one. The white ones are a little bit harder for you guys because they're th they're thin. They're very very thin. And uh, they're just a real pain to get on there. Oh, that was the wrong way. So I'm just going to flip this around. That should be right. Yep, there you go. So we're going to take our solder and we're going to just tap that right side and the left side. And that's it. That is all four blue white, blue, white, and that's for a customer.